Hello Grade 10 American System, this is Mrs. Nancy. Today I'm going to continue Section 12.3 Limiting Reagent and Percent Yield. Sample Problem 12.11 What is the percent yield if 13.1 grams CaO is actually produced when 24.8 grams CaCO3 is heated? So, use the equation for percent yield. And the theoretical yield for this problem was calculated in sample problem 12.10. So, percent yield equal actual yield divided by theoretical yield times 100% equal 13.20 grams divided by 13.90 grams times 100 equal 94.2%. Number 32. If 50 grams of silicon dioxide is heated with an excess of carbon, 27.9 grams of silicon carbide is produced. So, what is the percent yield of this reaction? Molar mass of SiO2 equals 60.1 grams per mole. So, step 1. Find the number of moles of silicon dioxide, which is equal to mass divided by molar mass, equal 50 grams divided by 60.1 gram per mole, equals 0.831 mole. Then, Write the number of moles of SiO2 divided by the coefficient 1 equal number of moles of silicon carbide divided by the coefficient 1. So the number of moles of SiC equal 0.831 mole. Then find the mass of silicon carbide which is equal to number of moles times molar mass equal 0.831 mole times 40.1 grams per mole and the answer equal 33.3 grams of SIC. Percent yield equal actual yield divided by theoretical yield times 100% equal 27.9 grams divided by 33.4 grams times 100% equal 83.5%. Number 33. If 15 grams of nitrogen reacts with 15 grams of hydrogen, 10.5 grams of ammonia is produced. What is the percent yield of this reaction? So start with finding the number of moles of nitrogen, which is mass divided by molar mass, equal 15 grams divided by 28 grams, equal 0.53 moles. Then find the number of moles of hydrogen, which is equal to mass divided by molar mass, equal 15 grams divided by 2, equal 7.5 moles. Then identify the limiting reagent. Number of moles of nitrogen divided by the coefficient 1 equals 0.53, while number of moles of hydrogen divided by the coefficient 3 equal 7.5 divided by 3 equals 2.5. So 0.53 less than 2.5, so nitrogen is the limiting reagent. Then write the number of moles of nitrogen divided by the coefficient 1 equal number of moles of ammonia divided by the coefficient 2. Number of moles of ammonia equal 2 times 0.53 equal 1.06 mole. Number of, then find the mass of ammonia, which is number of moles times molar mass, equal 18.02 grams. So percent yield equal actual yield divided by theoretical yield times 100% equal 10.5 divided by 18.02 times 100% equal 58%.